And now to some pretty emotional moments in a courtroom in Wayne County today as a 16 year old boy was sentenced to prison for murder. Antoine Perry was found guilty of shooting and killing 19 year old Devin Woods multiple times outside of a Wayne Athletic Center back in November. In court today, uh, that's now, Woods' yeah, mother there. She addressed the court and said from the moment that they walked out the f of the first hearing, they've had a target on their back. As soon as we walked out to the parking lot, his sister threatened me in the parking lot. Two days later, my dogs were poisoned. One of my dogs died. I am in fear for my life and my family's life because of this demon, and I hope and pray that you would give him the maximum sentence. Has, uh, defense attorney well, Perry will now spend between 25 and 40 years in prison. Ford Motor Company recalling now 58,000 Ford Focus and Focus ST cars because of a problem with the vehicle's software, which might fail to alert the driver that they're running low on fuel. Ford advises drivers to keep their fuel tanks above half full until they're able to visit a dealership and get it repaired. We have all the information that you need to know about this vehicle, these vehicles on our website. Just go to clickondetroit.com for that. All right, happening right now over on Belle Isle. Kids are out enjoying the sunshine, having fun at Metro Detroit Youth Day. This is an annual tradition that's all about encouraging children to play and stay active and focus on a bright future. Governor Gretchen Whitmer was at Belle Isle earlier this morning, and she thanked organizers for helping change lives. The Michigan Youth Appreciation Foundation, your scholarship program has helped students from all walks of life get on a path to post-secondary success, and to build a good life for themselves. It's changed lives, and because of this, we have more, we've got more lawyers and dentists and doctors and kids who got on a path to a career they enjoy.